Chanukah, Chanukah Sameach. This coming uh, Friday, Eid of Shabbat Chanukah, uh, it's a busy day, we'll speak about that more uh, on, on Friday, Bezat Hashem. But there's a machloket, because there's two lightings to do. There's Nerot Shabbat and Nerot Chanukah. The big machloket the poskim, which one comes first? Baal Elachot Gedolot writes that a person has to light Nerot Chanukah first, and then Nerot Shabbat. Because were a person to light Nerot Shabbat first, that constitutes a Kabbalah Shabbat, and then you wouldn't be able to light Nerot Chanukah afterwards. Most Rishonim disagree with that. Tosafot, Rash Baramban, Magid Mishnah B'Shem Rambam, and others, they all say, lighting Nerot Shabbat has nothing to do with accepting Shabbat. And therefore, the Rashba says uh, that a person should light Nerot Shabbat first, because if Tadir, Shabbat candles are more frequent, a person should light Nerot Shabbat, and then Nerot Chanukah. And Maran writes that they're right. Nevertheless, in Shulchan Aruch, Maran says, ma'ase, a person should preferably light Nerot Chanukah first, and then Nerot Shabbat. Now, if you're telling me that they're right, and Tadir, meaning the more frequent of two mitzvot, comes first, why are you telling me that? There's a few answers. Maran writes in Bet Yosef, he says that's only that you may light Shabbat candles first. But if you want, even according to that opinion, you can light Hanukkah candles first also. The Radbaz gives other reasons, and he says also because Ner Hanukkah is more chaviv, Ner Hanukkah is more beloved, it's more endeared mitzvah, and therefore we do that one first. So preferably a person should, on Erev Shabbat Chanukah, light Nerot Chanukah, and then Nerot Shabbat in order to satisfy all opinions. But if a person, let's say, made a mistake, the woman of the house lit Nerot uh, Shabbat first. Now, that certainly has no bearing on the husband. He can certainly light Nerot Chanukah afterwards, not a problem. But even if, let's say, it's the same person, let's say it's a man or a woman who lives alone, and by mistake, they lit Nerot Shabbat first, no problem. According to Marano Shulchan Aruch, lighting Nerot Shabbat does not constitute, as, as, as long as you're doing it within half an hour of Shkiah, it doesn't make a Kabbalah Shabbat, and it's not a problem at all to light Nerot Chanukah afterwards, Yom Tov.